When something gets wet, it usually appears darker. This can be observed with soil, sand, cloth, bricks. But what's the reason for this? How does water soaking into the material change its optical properties? When you look at a surface like sand or bricks, the light you are seeing is reflected by diffuse reflection. This is when light is reflected from a surface at many different angles, rather than just at one angle, as in the case of specular reflection. Many materials often appear darker when wet, due to the water reducing the amount of diffuse reflection from the outermost layer of that material. Since how dark we perceive a material to be depends on how much light is reflected toward our eyes, the net effect of the reduction of reflected light is that the object will now seem darker. As a good example, we can look at fabrics such as cotton, which under high magnification looks something like this. As you can see, the fabric is made of a bunch of micrometer-sized fibers, the gaps of which are usually filled by air. Now what is important for the optical properties of the material is that the fibers and the air have different refractive indices. This refractive index number is the measurement of the bending of a ray of light when passing through one medium to another. The net effect is that when air fills the pores in the fabric, it results in a large number of scattering events, resulting in a large amount of diffuse reflection. Now when you add water, the water molecules will displace the air inside the pores. And this is important because water has a refractive index of n equals 1.3, which is closer to that of the fabric, n equals 1.5. Due to the reduction of the refractive index mismatch, less light is scattered before entering the material. Instead, more of the light will either be simply transmitted through the fabric, or it will bounce around in the fabric or water layer due to a process called total internal reflection and eventually absorbed. The net effect is that the material will appear darker. We hope this video answered the question clearly and concisely. If you have any other questions that you would like us to tackle, make sure to leave them in the comments section below. And until next time, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.